Well, it's not quite May, but with just two days left until it, San Francisco's Japantown is kicking off AAPI Heritage Month festivities with a promise of street fair events coming up this summer. NBC Bay Area's Christy Smith has more on that and the efforts to get people back into this neighborhood. Dozens of people gathering in San Francisco's Japantown. I think it's amazing. I'm mean, able to uh, learn about the different dances, traditions. You know, I, I think it's, I think has been really, really good. It's great to bring people out from different communities to come out here and experience the culture of here in Japantown and the Asian culture in general. It's a kickoff to AAPI Heritage Month in May, but there will be a series of events here this summer. Today is our first kind of what we call the pop-up, and this is a partnership with uh, the Asian Heritage Foundation. And then July 29th, we're going to have a free concert, a whole one called the Aloha uh, by the Bay. And we get a lot of Hawaiian musicians that come out and play and everything. And then August 5th and 6th will be actual or Neo Machi Street Fair for two days. Getting people back out in neighborhoods in San Francisco on the other side of the pandemic. Still struggling a little bit. You know, it's, it's better because people are now coming out. Mayor London Breed helps set the tone at Peace Plaza. We talk about San Francisco as being a global city a place of diversity, and that diversity is maintained by culture. It's by, maintained by the history. A robust month of programming is expected in the city. I think we are hoping that there's something for everyone, for different generations. Christy Smith, NBC Bay Area News.